Kevin Hawks has been on the scene all day long. He joins us now from the state police barracks in Royalton. John, take it from here. Yeah, Liz, that's right. I'm here at the Royalton Police Barracks where officials are still trying to piece together everything that happened leading to a trooper involved serious collision earlier this morning. Vermont State Police tell us around 8.30 a.m. a trooper was responding to an accident on Interstate 89 in the northbound lanes just north of the Bethel exit. Exit 3 near, near mile marker 23. That's when they say a cruiser hit a fire truck that was stopped on the highway already on the scene responding to an overturned box truck just a little further north. The cruiser smashed into the guardrail, result, resulting in significant damage to the car. The Vermont State Trooper's name has not been released, but were told that they are in critical condition and were airlifted to Dartmouth Hitchcock Medical Center in Lebanon earlier this morning. The section of the interstate where the crash happened was closed for hours as authorities used drones and high-tech equipment to try to better understand what happened. Crews have the roads cleared now and northbound travel has reopened. We're here at the barracks waiting to learn more information. For now, live in Royalton, John Hawks, NBC5 News.